one of the key things is, is that we know that while many patients do benefit from consolidation immunotherapy, that there are some patients who clearly are not benefiting. And actually, some patients are doing quite well with just chemo radiation alone. So really trying to identify which patients actually need any immunotherapy at all, because maybe the chemo radiation was, uh, was uh, sufficient to cure their disease. Which patient population do you give consolidation immunotherapy to for whom it's really a futile effort? They're, they're really not going to benefit. And then third, do we really need to give a year of consolidation immunotherapy to all patients? Um, perhaps some patients need consolidation immunotherapy, but maybe they are cured after three or four or six treatments and they don't really fully need a full year of treatment.